Hello and welcome everyone to my next modern day let's play. Yep, I have chosen Uncharted Drake's Fortune to my next modern day let's play. Because, well, to be honest, it's such a ama an amazing game. So let's get started here, let's start a gra brand new game. Um, yeah, why not? Let's keep the treasures. I'm going to go for easy difficulty because I don't really like anything harder than easy difficulty. Here off the coast of Panama, where we just recovered what we believe to be the coffin of legendary explorer Sir Francis Drake, who was buried at sea over 400 years ago. Are you sure you want to be defiling your ancestors' remains like that? You make it sound so dirty. <laughs> Besides, I thought you didn't believe me. Well, I did do my research, and apparently Francis Drake didn't have any children. Well, history can't be wrong, you know. <clears throat> For example, you can't defile an empty coffin. What the hell? <laughs> you devil. What is it? Come on, hold it up. No, 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 no way. Deal was for a coffin. That's it. Wait a minute. If my show hadn't have funded this expedition, hey, hey, you wouldn't you have... got your story, lady. Look, Mr. Drake, you signed a contract. <laughs> I have a right to see no, every single thing that... could you hold that thought? Sully, uh, we got some trouble. Hurry it up. Okay, okay. What's going on? Uh... Pirates. Pirates? Yeah, the modern kind. They don't take prisoners. At least not male prisoners. Wait, what are you talking about? Uh, sh shouldn't we call the authorities or something? Yeah, that'd be a great idea, but we don't exactly have a permit to be here. What? Yeah, so unless you want to end up in a Panamanian jail, we should probably handle this ourselves. But what's worse? You obviously haven't been in a Panamanian jail. Do you know how to use one of these? Uh, yeah, it's like a camera. You just you point and shoot, right? Good girl. Here we go. <sighs> and so the fun begins. How the hell they find us out here? These guys have been telling me for weeks. Thought I lost them. Uh, it's kind of a long story. <laughs> okay, let's get behind the crate. So this game is actually set like a movie, like the actual game, the game will feel like a movie, so if you feel like making it feel more like a movie, make sure you put it on 720p and make it full screen. There's no other way you're going to get the full experience of this game otherwise. The graphics, as you can see, are amazing. They use the full full capacity of the Blu-ray disc on the, on the PS3 here. So as you can see, you know, graphics are amazing, and this is just the first oh, no, game. Don't. So I mean, you haven't even seen the graphics in like the second or the third game. They are absolutely amazing. I mean, if you haven't played Uncharted yet and you have a PS3, you should definitely, definitely consider getting the Uncharted series. I think you can get like one or two in a bundle now for about £10, and I'm not sure what free is now because it's still quite modern, so I'm not sure about free's price yet, but uh, that's up to you. I mean, if you haven't actually got a PS3, then this, this is going to be even more of an exciting series for you because it's definitely one that you're going to want to consider watching. It's such an amazing game. It's set out like a movie, as I've already said. So, you know, the sense of humor is amazing. The battle mechanics are amazing. Everything about this game is amazing. It's on one of my top five games. So, you know, along with the other two, obviously. I consider them to be a trilogy. So, I mean, I'm kind of disappointed because I heard that Naughty Dog aren't really planning on making a fourth one of these. 
So that's kind of disappointing, but I guess you'll see what I'm talking about as we go through the game. But for now, all we're doing is shooting pirates. Which isn't too hard. Okay. No. Oh god, no, watch out! Oh my god, great. Oh my god. Yeah, no shit! Oh fucking hell, he's got like cover behind this. Are you serious? Holy shit, holy shit. Yeah, Sully's here, nice! Well, there's the ammo. Oh, this is not good. Damn it. Is the boat blowing up? Ship's gonna blow. We gotta jump. Oh wait! What are you doing? Okay. Come on. Okay. Go. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't leave you alone for a minute, can I? I had everything under control until they blew up the boat. <laughs> you all right? Nothing the years of therapy won't fix. Well, if it isn't the beautiful and talented Elaine Fisher. Flattery will get you screen time. Yeah, I'm more of a behind-the-scenes kind of guy. Victor Sullivan. Huh. <laughs> ah, for Christ's sakes. <sighs> what do you say we get out of here? Before we attract any more attention. Well? A little present from Sir Francis. Ho oh, ho, so you found the coffin. Wait a minute, is this what I think it is? <laughs> Drake's lost diary. He faked his death, just like I said, Sully. He must have been onto something big. Yeah, well, let's just keep that between us. Thanks for the loan, Mr. Drake. I think I've earned a look at that diary when we land. So look, when Drake sailed into the Pacific, he took the Spanish fleet completely by surprise. He captured their ships, he took all their maps, their letters, their journals, and he recorded everything in this diary. Uh-huh, so this... But when he got back to England, Queen Elizabeth confiscated all of his charts and logbooks, including this one, and then swore his entire crew to silence. Yeah, so this... You see, Drake discovered something on that voyage, Sully. Something so secret and so valuable, they couldn't risk it getting out. All right, Nate, just pretend for a minute that I don't really care about any of that stuff and cut to the chase, would you? <sighs> a man only interested in the climax. He must be a real hit with the ladies. Never had any complaints. Okay, then. I'll jump to the good part, just for you. Ho, ho, ho. Huh? El goddamn Dorado. He was onto something big, all right. Does it say anything else? Oh, so now you're interested, huh? Yeah. Well, unfortunately, no. Last page was torn out. I'm telling you, Sully. This is it. This is finally it. Yeah. Only... We got one little problem. Yes, that's what I said. It blew up. It sank. No, that's why we have insurance, right? Oh. Oh no, the camera? No, the camera's fine. Don't worry about the camera, no. It's still as good as new. Sully, the girl can hold her own. You should have seen her. Fine. You go on out there and you tell her, we just found the lost city of gold. Maybe her producer can get it on the air tonight. Oh, come on. Nate, do you trust me? More or less. <laughs> good. Because we're gonna have every two-bit scumbag in the world racing us to this treasure unless we cut her loose right now. You're a real gentleman, Sully. I know. It stinks. She'll get over it. No, I don't... I don't care for over budget. I mean, do you realize that this could be, like, the biggest story of the year? <laughs> Hi. No, I don't trust him, okay? That's why we need to move fast. So just get me the camera crew, and I promise you that... Son of a bitch. Hey! Should have seen that one coming. Ugh.
Hold on. Hold on, kid. I'm not as young as I used to be. <laughs> uh, yeah, you weren't too old for that little barmaid in Lima, were you? Ha! <laughs> well, that was different. Although, I must admit, equally as strenuous. <laughs> well, hang in there, old-timer. We're just about there. You know, this reminds me. Did I ever tell you about the time I pawned a flock of 15th century off on Pablo Escobar? <laughs> uh, risky move, but by the time he figured it out, I was... Hanging on every word. I like the comedy aspect in this game. I've, I'm going to make the uh, the first episode quite long, about 20-25 minutes maybe, just so you can get a real feel for the game, along with cutscenes, gameplay, you know, all that mixed into one long video, you know, just for the first video. You really think Francis Drake came all the way up here, huh? Yeah, as the series goes on, I'll make them a bit shorter. Maybe around 15, 17 minutes. Well? I don't get it. According to this, we're right on top of the mark. Maybe you're not reading that thing right. Let me see it. No, this is the place. There's nothing here, Nate. Another goddamn dead end. Easy, Sully. Just relax. Let's take a look around. So for those who are actually familiar with Tomb Raider, this is where the puzzles come in. Yep, there's puzzles in this game, viewers. It's a lot like uh, Tomb Raider in a way. This is like trying to find a bride in a brothel. There are a lot of similarities to Uncharted and Tomb Raider. This is more like it. A lot with like, you know, the gameplay and and like, you know, all the climbing stuff, the puzzles, etc, etc. Yeah, it's older than that. Like 2,000 years older. So yeah, we got to actually try and figure out what the hell's going on so that we can actually get into where we want to go. Which is, I believe, the path, well not the path to El Dorado, but a path to somewhere leading to El Dorado. Because, you know, nothing gets given away on the same, on the right... You know, at the beginning of the game. Hey, oh, it'd be too funny easy. About the ground down there. It's made of wood, isn't it? I believe that we have to chuck a rock on it, which would solve all our problems. Oh God, run! That's all right. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Give me a minute. The reason I started with number one is because I'm thinking about maybe doing all three on my channel, but not one after the other, obviously. I mean, if you guys want me to do the other two, let me know. I won't do them one, like, you know, along one straight after the other, because I'm going to be busy with, like, stuff that's going to be coming out over the years, or over the, over the next year, but I will find time. When there's not really much going on, I'll probably do, like, one, uh, you know, another one of the Uncharted games, but it'll be a Good while since, like, until then. For now, I believe we just drop down. Because obviously you can't just drop down from like a really high height because Nate breaks his legs. So that wouldn't be a good idea. Let's see what's down here then. Oh, doorway! Oh, oh, oh. Bats are in every game I try and play, viewers. Every game! Sun Hill, Dead Space 2. My gosh. They just won't leave me alone. All right, so let's see what's going on down here. Puzzles, I believe. What a warm and homey place, eh? <laughs> well, not quite what you were expecting, huh? Yeah. Where's all the damn gold? Yeah, this place was picked clean centuries ago. No good limey pirate. No, it wasn't Drake. Check this out. Looks like the Spanish got here before he did. What the hell, Sully? Nate, I'm not looking for a lousy piece of tin. I'm up to my eyeballs in debt. I was really counting on this one. Too many big bar tabs in Lima, I guess. <laughs> that and, well, just a few bad deals. 
Yeah, well, I always told you to stay away from the bad guys. And the bad girls. Yeah? Look who's talking. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? That reporter? I saw the way you were eyeing her. Elena? Please. I snuffed any chance with her the second we ditched her on that dock. <laughs> All's fair in love and war, kid. Yeah. Uh, and what if you can't tell the difference? Then, my friend, you are in big trouble. Well, that's fair enough. I forget. I know you can smash these somehow, but I forget how to do it. I wonder. Okay. Okay, so usually there's something in them, but obviously not that time. Really? You're not kidding. Yeah, I guess that much. Oh, did I see something shiny over there? <gasps> a treasure! We gotta find a way across. Now, let's just be careful now. Alright. You can actually just view the treasure straight after you get them, but I'm just skipping them for now. I see a TNT barrel! Conveniently placed. You might want to be quick on this, it doesn't look very stable. Good God. I really actually like the relationship between uh, Nathan Drake and Sully there. It's really nice, like, to have a really good relationship in a game. With, like, between two characters. I'm doing this wrong. Let's see. Oh, you got to tap it. I was tapping it the first time, that's why I thought I was doing it wrong. I was just, like, holding it in for a second then. Here, let me do that. Oh, well... Well, I had to do that just so you could do it? Really? Come on, Sully, you got to know better than that. Oh, what's this? I'll hold it. See if you can jam it from the other side. Probably with this, maybe. This should work. It's made of wood. All right, let go. This ought to hold it. Yeah, for Hurry, a second. Sully. Get it, get it. Well, there it goes. That was a little too close. Let's hope this place has a door. Huh? Well, hopefully, I was. We're going to be starving today. I think there's something in Drake's journal about this. Oh, here comes the Drake's journal part. Yeah, here it is. Looks like this thing is some kind of lamp or brazier. See if you can light it. So, oh. after all your bitching about the cigar, now it comes in handy, huh? <laughs> I love the sense of humor. It's amazing. You're going to be getting a lot of that uh, throughout the game. Sort of like a... I, I really like the whole movie aspect to it. Like, no game really does this apart from Uncharted, which is what I like about it. It makes it so unique. Okay, now what? Does that light all the wood on fire, or what? Maybe we got to shoot that down. Oh, it works! I was just guessing there. I didn't actually know what to do. But I'm guessing that is what you gotta do. Oh, what is this? Oh, wow. Um, okay. Let's figure this out slowly. I'm sure we'll be able to find a way down. Uh, let's see here. Is that water down there? I think that's water. Maybe we can jump into that. Uh, well, let's try it, I guess. Nope. Nope, that killed me. Alright, let's... There's got to be something else. Oh, here we go, here we go, this works. Uh, Nate. Not fun! I might have been able to do that 30 years ago. It's alright. Leave it to me, I can do it. You should be a bit younger, Sully. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, wait, can we grab onto that tree, or...? I'm just going left and hoping for the best. Or right, rather. I don't even know my right from my left. So we, I, I, there is a way to break them without shooting them, but I just can't remember what it is. And there is something inside them. One day I shall prove you all wrong. Oh, here we go. Oh, look, a ladder. Conveniently placed. But, you know, I'm going to be posting a lot of this, I think, because it's I, I tend to do the modern day series quite a lot. So, yeah, I'll be posting a lot more Uncharted and a lot more Dead Space 2. Probably be holding off on the Spyro quite a bit. It takes a lot more... It takes a lot more out of me to do the Spyro series than the other two, so... 
You'll be seeing a lot more of Uncharted and Dead Space 2 over the ne over the next couple of weeks. But yeah, if you enjoyed this uh, video, let me know. You know, hit that like button. Just let me know with, you know, like, favourite, comment, whatever you want to do. All free, maybe. Or even a share button. I mean, that might be cool. <laughs> I found out actually today I'm a bad I'm a bad British citizen because I can't make a good cup of tea. I'm like a disgrace to my country because I just I can't make a good cup of tea. I just can't do it. Wait, I recognize these symbols. The order of these signs has some importance. Interesting. I think there is a way you can turn the pages, but I, not right now, obviously. So wait a minute, let's see here. Uh, oh, okay, these puzzles. So what, we step on these, or...? Okay, the symbol's there. Right, okay. I'm trying to figure out this, like, quite slowly. Let's see what's up here. Oh! I have no idea what that did. Oh, okay, okay, I think I've... Alright, alright, let me, let me... Hold on, let me look at the journal quickly. Okay, so one, two, three, four. So the first one is that little... Okay, so it's obviously not that one. So the first symbol is like a little sort of cube thing, I guess? I need to go around and jump over here. Okay, so it's not... It's not this symbol. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to do that! Jesus! Alright, let's get up here. Get up here again. I'm pretty sure I know where the next symbol is now. Alright, so this is the first one. Hey, something's happening. And then what... The second one... Let's see here. The second one is a little man with a sword. Okay, so where's the man with the sword? Over here, maybe? Wait, that's not... No, that's not the man with the sword. The man with the sword, I believe, is the first one I hit, isn't it? Or is it this one? I think... I'm pretty sure it's this one. Yep, there you go. There's number two. What's the third one? The third one is the little tiki guy. So that's back there. So it's all well, all's well that ends well. So this is the third one. I'm actually recording this on uh, on New the day before New Year's Eve. So let me get, let me know like by the time you watch this, New Year's uh, would have already passed us. So let me know if you had a good New Year's. I mean, I I'm certainly looking forward to mine. I'm having a house party with about 13 friends over, so should be good for me. But let me know if you had a good New Year's. I, I'm interested to know. Interesting. Pretty deep. Yeah, looks like there's a ladder cut into the side. Wait here while I check it out. All right, just be careful. All right, well, next time we'll be going down the ladder. Because I feel like I've given you uh, quite a long episode, you know. First episode, I want to make it extra long so that you get a good feel of the game. Cutscenes and all. So you add a bit of cutscenes, gameplay, puzzles, fighting, you know, everything in one. So next time we'll be going into the little deep dark abyss pit here. And I shall see you all next time. So if you liked the video, please leave me a like. That would really help me out a lot and let me know you're enjoying the series. And other than that, if you've already subscribed to me, if you haven't done so, uh, please subscribe to me if you haven't done so already. And I shall see you all next time. So other than that, all that's to say for me is farewell. Oh, fuck. This is not good. What the hell happened to Sully?